What if a country that began with a free market has been transformed into a system of private ownership and government control? What if we went from an imperfect form of capitalism to an abominable form of corporatism? What if the government decided whom to enrich and whom to keep poor? What if individual economic interests didn't match the interests of the government? What if the government viewed a free market economy as a threat to its own interests? What if the government benefited most when it controlled the economy? What if we were living in an age of de Tocqueville's grim warning that a republic will crumble when the government learns to bribe the people with their own money? What if our economy were being suffocated not only by excess regulations, but also by an active attempt by the government to take over the economy, sector by sector? What if government bureaucrats grew stronger as the private sector grew weaker? What if the load-bearing walls of the entitlement state were buckling under the pressure of excess spending? What if the pillars of free enterprise were buckling under the pressure of excess taxation? What if the Occupy Wall Street protesters were being manipulated and pushed and prodded into ex expressing the basest feelings of greed, class envy, and jealousy? What if they were being infiltrated by agents of the government in order to drive demonstrators towards incre increasingly radical, anti-capitalist, and even violent rhetoric? What if the same government that was pretending to prosecute them really supported them? What if the government uses the angst these people have brought about to ratchet up the nationalization of our economy? What if the government could take any private property it wanted, so long as it paid a fair price? What if the government found ways to take any private property it wanted without paying any price? What if the government produced misleading reports so the economy appeared to grow when it really was shrinking? What if the government made the economy look good like it was growing by stealing money from people's earnings and savings just to fund more government spending? What if some of America's largest corporations were no longer profitable except when they received money from the government? What if government regulators were really bought and paid for and the regulatory scheme was really a facade to empower the regulators and enrich the people being regulated? What if regulations never really even protected you? What if they always served to advance the interests of companies rich enough to capture regulators, but not innovative enough to compete in the free market? What if the centralization of power in the hands of government never served to protect the people? What if regulations stole freedom and simply made it easier for those who didn't want to compete in a free market to use government force to maintain their dominance? What if we didn't need the government in order to have a healthy economy? What if we could have an economy based on the free market, where the voluntary exchanges of goods and services drives all economic activity? What if we were free from government fiat and manipulation? What if free people could shun the government's economy in favor of a free market they cultivate outside the purview of government? What if our money had real value? What if the federal government decided what time of day it is? What if the federal government made it a law that you had to change every clock in your house whenever it told you to do so? What if the bureaucrats forced you to change your clock so that your children had to walk home from school in the dark? What if we were a nation of sheep who just accepted all this? What if Democrats weren't the only ones who thought they could manage the economy? What if Republicans claimed that they could manage it too? What if almost all Republicans and all Democrats really believed in big government? What if all the major Republican presidential candidates have indicated they believe that they can best manage the economy, except for one of them? What if that one says that if he were elected, he wouldn't manage the economy at all? He'd turn it over to the free choices of free people. What if the elites in banking and government and in both political parties feared this candidate and didn't want you to hear from him? What if he were actually elected president? What if we were free again? What if the whole purpose of government was to negate freedom? What if freedom was a myth? What if the Constitution meant nothing to the government? What if everything the government has or owns or controls has been stolen? What if I'm right? What if the government is wrong? What if it's dangerous to be right when the government is wrong? What's next? What if we don't know what's next?